joins us now with your forecast. And here we go. March is like roar. Oh, March is lion great. Going on. The lion is beginning to gear up. Yes, to indeed. Start with. You know what? When I show you the first seven days of March, you might say, you know what? Let's just keep February. February is not oh, so boy. bad, right? March is coming in in a really rough way. We've got several chances at rain and snow, and then we've got a blast of some very, very unseasonably cold air for the first full week of the new month. So let's get right into it. The faster we dive in, the faster we over, right? Storm Scan 3 showing our next system really starting to gain some strength back across portions of Ohio and points south. You can see snow breaking out in Ohio and Indiana right now. This is headed our direction overnight. Not a ton of moisture with this system, but timing is everything. And this system coming in just just before the start of the morning commute. So that means the roads will be coated when a lot of people get up and leave their house tomorrow morning, leading to some slick conditions. And not only that, the earlier you're up, the snow could be steady for a while. That could lead to some reduced visibility out there with the flakes flying at your windshield, especially if you leave before the light, before the sun comes up. Winter weather advisory, you can see the areas shaded in purple. These are the areas that will see the most impact from this system. It's not a ton of snow anywhere. It's a couple of inches at best for most of us, maybe closer to three in some of our far western areas. But it is coming right around the time of the morning commute, 10, 1 a.m. to 10 a.m. That's the winter weather advisory time. So these areas expect a rough go tomorrow morning. Future weather shows by 3 a.m. Snow is breaking out. Now the steadiest of the snow should be from about 3 a.m. to 7 a.m. You can see even by 6, the snow starts to weaken off a little bit. Down over South Jersey and Delaware still steady, but then 9 a.m. It's not really doing much of anything. Tomorrow evening, that system lifts back to the north. We'll see rain showers tomorrow night into Saturday morning, maybe some snow showers to the north. Then that system is out of here. Then we wait for the next one. Showers starting off to the west Sunday afternoon, but it's Sunday night. That storm will impact us. So a general coating to two inches overnight and into early Friday morning for the majority of the area. Maybe some locally higher amounts in this region, Newcastle County, Chester County, Lancaster County. There will be some mixing down the shore in southern Delaware that will keep things a little bit quieter there. The timeline, snow heaviest from 4 to 7 a.m. for your Friday morning. Rain showers Friday evening, just some clouds and drizzle Saturday, but then a rain snow chance on Sunday night. And that one looks like a very, very strong storm. So light snow overnight tonight. Your eyewitness weather seven day forecast brings that next storm in Sunday night into Monday. As of now, this looks like potentially substantial snow from the Lehigh Valley up to the Poconos may start as snow in the city and then change over to heavy rain Sunday night, mainly rain for the shore in Delaware, but that could change. And if that system comes in a little colder or tracks a little further south, you could be talking about a better chance Sunday night into Monday morning for some more substantial snow around mm. the city. So we just have to keep watching how that evolves. What we do know is it's going to be really cold all next week. Okay. <laughs> we need some hope. Yeah, yes, we need we, some hope. Well, we have